Are we finally close to the launch of Pulse Chain? In this video, we'll be looking into if Richard Hart is giving the time frame of Pulse Chain's launch anytime soon. Hello and welcome to AB Crypto. If you are new to our channel, just hit the subscribe button below and hit the notification bell to receive any new video updates. You can also follow us on TikTok and Instagram at underscore AB Crypto underscore. And if you want to read some more about today's topic in our blog, you can get the links down in the description below. Also, sending the AB Crypto team a super thanks donation goes a long way for helping us to continue to provide content for you. We thank you for your support. Without further ado, let's get started. As we've entered the last quarter of 2022, for obvious reasons, all eyes are towards the launch of Pulse Chain and the end of what seems to be the everlasting bear market. It's been more than a year since Pulse Chain's sacrifice phase came to an end, and since then, we've seen the testnet work flawlessly, which also hints the line of code that will run on Pulse Chain is there and is only getting more rigorously fixed by the 14 developers of Pulse Chain so that when everything is public, it runs without any issues. This is why many people believe Pulse Pulse Chain won't take much longer to go live from here on forward. Because unlike Hex, where Richard Hart wanted things to be 101%, as you really cannot change them once everything goes public, that isn't the case with Pulse Chain. Because even when it goes live, developers do have the freedom for updates, which can also be done through the help of community voting. So from this, we know Pulse Chain doesn't need two years of development to go public. And this is exactly what Crypto7 talked about in his recent live stream, giving the community a positive outlook on things from here onwards. For one, the most important thing Crypto7 needs the community to understand is why we're currently in a bear market. And with this, we can also understand if Richard Hart is timing the market or not. Things for the crypto market went down almost a year ago when the big players, aka the whales, learned that inflation is rising and the feds are printing more money. The moment these whales learned that, they they started to exit from their positions. Because with more money being printed, there will be an obvious liquidity issue in the market. So for them, it was the best time to leave their positions and go back with whatever profits they made. The result? An obvious ripple effect. As the price of Bitcoin started to decline, others followed to the point where we are right now. But now things do seem to be changing for the better as the feds are starting to cool down a bit. Secondly, he talked about how it's becoming obvious from the tone of Richard Hart that he's pushing his development to finally get things done. Hart understands that he cannot stretch too long and now more than ever wants his developers to realize this as well. Because extending Pulse Chain's launch for too long, especially from this point, could hurt all the hard work he's done. So to ensure things are compiled quickly, he is pushing his 14 developers to give their all and get done with Pulse Chain. We don't know for sure, but there can certainly be an element of the dev team getting lazy and thus procrastinating. And if that's the case, it has to come to an end. And this is a bit obvious from the tone of Richard Hart. And before we get to our last reason, if you want to get ahead of the game for PulseX, make your way to PulseXTokens.com. Here you can also list new token projects for free, vote for your community's project, and utilize their free PulseX faucet for 100 PulseX per day that will be queued up and given to you at launch, all in exchange for simply getting their name out there. They have also just launched a Richard Hart style clothing line and even accept Hex's payment. You can use my personal links down below and can become an affiliate yourself to earn 20% from any users who join using your link. Lastly, Crypto7 talked about how Richard Hart is talking in his interviews about the market to bottom in the next three months. And from there, we will start to see greens. According to Hart, the bottom of the market will be when Bitcoin sees a low of 10k. Since Bitcoin has already seen a low of 17.5k in June, expecting it to see 10k or even 11k considering where we stand right now in terms of macro indicators is not that impossible. So if we're to take all of these things into account talked about by Crypto7, this definitely means Pulse Chain's launch is much closer and the date will be revealed soon as this helps to counter the two main arguments about the delay in Pulse Chain's launch. The first is timing the market and the second is Pulse Chain's code not being ready yet. About timing the market, we know inflation isn't going to end anytime soon. So Bitcoin will touch a bottom of 10k and once it 
does, it gives more leverage to the big players to re-enter Bitcoin at 10k than for them to re-enter at 20k or 25k. So in all fairness, the market is soon to touch its bottom. And about Pulse Chain's code not being complete yet, we know developers have had a fair amount of time, and we also know that they've already found the bugs which they want to fix. Therefore, it is about time for them to get the job done and give the community what they've been waiting for. So while all of this is happening, one really important thing that the community often forgets to talk about is how this all affects Hex. Because the moment Richard Hart gives clarity on the launch of Pulse Chain, this will seriously drive up the price of Hex, which can touch from 25 cents to even 50 cents. Hart knows he can push Hex to the moon, but he's waiting for the right moment to do that so his entire ecosystem shines together at the right time with the right expectations. Therefore, people who believe in Richard Hart's ecosystem need to buy and hold Hex right now because it is at a discount. So, to put things simply, we're as close to Paul Shane's launch as we can get. And this is the right time for the community to keep an eye on Richard Hart because he'll announce Paul Shane's launch time frame anytime soon. So, what do you think? Do you also believe that Richard Hart is giving the launch date of Pulse Chain soon or not? Like always, don't forget to share your thoughts and opinions with us in the comment section down below. This brings us to the end of today's video. We hope you guys found this video resourceful and entertaining. And if you have any more information to add to improve to the content in this video, please do so down in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And if you loved watching this video, send us those likes. We thank you guys for watching and see you in our next video.